now we want to change their scale. So we'll create a vector since it's dealing with x, y, and z. So you need three pieces of the data for that. Custom scale. And hit enter. Okay. So we're going to do the same sort of thing as we did for the custom index. However, there's one more step we need to do. If we were to let's just type this out, copy it down here, and it's a vector. I'm assuming you know what that is. If not, ask. If we did this, it's going to get a random number for x, y, and z that are different from each other, like so 1, 2, and 3. So your shape's going to be distorted. If you want it to be scaled uniformly, first you have to declare a float variable. And we're going to use that one float it generates at birth. And then we're going to plug it in here. So we'll call it scale num and it equals a random value between, I don't know, point 0.2 and 4, for example. So then we can just take this. And paste it right here. Oops. I tried to copy it again. There we go. Alright. Oh, we got a syntax error. Put a dollar sign here. Okay, so after we get our expressions written, we can go up here to our particle again under our instance or tab and set the scale to custom scale. And now when we play it, everything has a different scale. Like here's two toruses, different scale.